Hi everybody, uh, so I have to film this really quickly. I'm on nights again, giant surprise, but uh, it is weigh-in Wednesday, so I'm gonna weigh myself and do my little emotional weigh-in, I guess. And uh, yeah, I'm really happy uh, about where I am. Actually, I'm a little bit higher than I have been weighing myself. I think I actually got down to about 165 earlier, and like that's awesome because that's pretty much like a memorable weight that I was from high school so like I'm getting to places that I haven't been for a very long time and I feel really really great about that and yeah just keeping up the work and you know doing my best and it's paying off and I'm really excited about that. Uh, I have to do this really quickly because I actually have to you know like try to edit this as quickly as possible and then leave uh, there's pretty much going to be no editing, so here's my stream of consciousness. Uh, relating to last week when I was talking about how there was something kind of that might be coming up that would be stressful for me and that might affect my focus specifically on kind of what I'm doing with uh, weight loss and everything, I was offered a job in another province. So for American friends who maybe aren't as familiar with Canada, that basically means that I am moving to another state. I have accepted the offer and we basically have like a month uh, to pack all of our belongings and our two cats and get everything ready to go and find a new place to live and do all of that. So it's definitely something where historically I probably would have done a lot of emotional eating and stuff like that so we'll see how it sort of works out for me. I'm, I'm gonna have to kind of not be focused or anything but just sort of try to avoid the desire to eat everything in sight because I'm stressed out. So yeah we are looking at and applying to places and that's kind of a weird thing because we have to do it from afar. We can't really go see these places so like that also makes things more difficult because then landlords don't really get to meet you so they don't really want to rent to you because you're kind of an unknown like you're basically just you know a name on a page or a text or a phone call or whatever you're not a real person that they get to see and they can see how you present yourself and do you show up on time and so on and so forth so hopefully we find a place I guess is uh, where I'm going with that but um yeah, I'm very excited for the move. Like the job opportunity is fantastic. It is still a lab related job. It's kind of just like one of the more side ones. I will, I guess, discuss it more. It'll probably be months after this, uh, but when I'm doing a lot more of it, I'll discuss it more. And when I'm kind of like more comfortable with it and what it entails, maybe I'll just kind of bring up what I do. But uh, basically for people who also do lab work or are familiar with lab work, I am essentially no longer going to be testing patient samples. I'm doing more of a support role. Um, yeah, involving like machinery and middleware and everything like that. So I'm really excited about it. I am really excited to go. I can't wait to kind of just go on this new adventure, but at the same time, all the stresses that kind of go hand in hand with it would definitely be something that would make me want to eat. Uh, actually, when we moved out to where we are now, which we moved for my job, um, I wound up kind of like stress eating a lot. Like I gained a lot of weight fairly quickly and it was because I was, you know, all kind of by myself. Our support network was gone and I just ate to comfort myself. So it's something where like I'm aware that that's something that I have done previously. So I'm going to be working really hard on it to not do it again, essentially. But yeah, I'm going to be filming some stuff relating to it. I was thinking of doing like a um, come pack with me sort of thing or like, you know, like kind of watch me pack my life away. Uh, obviously we would speed that up. It'd be so boring to just watch me individually put things in uh, boxes, but you know, maybe if we find some fun stuff while we're packing. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. I'll be a lot less nervous, I think, once we actually have a place where we're moving to move into. Um, 
honestly, like that will be kind of when I, you know, can breathe deeply and go, okay, I can relax. But uh, yeah, it's exciting and uh, hopefully you guys can join me along for the ride.